Mike Musatelli remembers watching year after year as lawmakers shut down the legalization of professional mixed martial arts in New York State. Musatelli has dedicated more than nine years of his life to MMA, yet he has never fought in front of a home crowd. There have been times over the course of those nine plus years that Musatelli got tired of waiting and thought about quitting, but he knows that he wouldn't be able to sleep at night if he did back away from the sport. It's easy to give up in this sport. A lot of people do it after one loss, two losses. But I love it, man. I'm, I wouldn't trade it for anything that I've ever done. It's the greatest thing that I ever attempted. He has had 11 professional fights in states such as Mississippi, Oklahoma, and Connecticut, to name a few. And the Syracuse native has always been the bad guy, a role he has embraced over the years. But just once, he would like to be the hometown hero instead of the guy spoiling everyone else's day. And traveling for fights is hard on Musatelli and his supporters. Musatelli works full-time as the manager of a transmission shop, so he has to take off work to fight. His coaches, too, have to miss time at work and pay for gas, hotels, and meals during the trips. Having a fight in Syracuse would not only give Musatelli the chance to fight in front of a home crowd, but it would make life easier for those who support him. Being here, hell, they could wake up, go to work at day, and then go coach at night. You know, that'd be amazing for them. It'd be amazing for all the people that want to support me, too. They don't have to make a two-day voyage out of it. They just wake up and do it. It'd be awesome. While Musatelli doesn't have any fights lined up just yet, he is definitely looking to fight professionally in New York by the end of this year. And he would not pass up any chance to fight in his hometown. I would literally wake up in the morning and say, what? Yeah? Okay, done. I'd be in there tomorrow. Yes. <laughs> don't even need to hear the number. Don't even need to hear that. I don't care. $500, 250 a cheeseburger? Sure. Because I love the sport and the chance to do it with a crowd of a couple hundred cheering instead of, you know, listening to my sister shriek over a loud crowd. Yeah, yeah. Awesome. Are you kidding me? I'd do it right now.